So guys, we are definitely pregnant. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Brittany, and this is a crazy video. <laughs> um, I'm sure I'm gonna re record it, but I just want to record my symptoms. I am pregnant, apparently, <laughs> which is crazy to me to even say that. I don't even think I would say that out loud, but I'm pregnant, which is awesome. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I have. <laughs> been a very stressful week just with um it's been awesome like finding out that I was pregnant and like the tests were like so dark right away I literally dipped them in looked at them before I even put them down they were positive which is crazy to me this came up literally right away like we had it on for one second and then it was positive isn't that amazing let me show you Um, but yeah, and I took a two tests the first day, um, then I took, uh, one test the second day, which was just as darker, probably a bit darker, I think, and then, um, later on that day, I took another test at the doctor's office, and it was positive too, and I took one this morning, um, and that one was <laughs> worrying me a little bit, but... Um, I went to the doctors today too. Um, I went to the clinic yesterday and then the doctors today. And yeah, he says everything is seems really good. Um, he kind of put my mind at ease for some things that we had been worried about and thinking about. And because um, I was having implantation bleeding and I didn't know what that's supposed to look like, and I was so worried. And I was like, oh my god, what is happening? Um, but, like, I had that before... Well, I guess it makes sense. It was before my positives. Like, it was, like, three days or so. And then it was probably two or three days of nothing. And then it was, like, lots of CM with brown tinted um, spotting kind of thing. Um, off and on. And now it's completely stopped for the last, like day and a half two days so that's really good um but yeah he said that's just implantation bleeding don't worry about it um and I was really I was just so nervous I was like I've been a wreck about it but like yeah he made me feel so much better I got my blood drawn today and I have um a little card that the lady said I can come in anytime because my doctor knows I have an anxiety disorder um he treats me like for it and stuff like that so yeah, he was like, just to ease your mind or whatever, I'll give you a standing order, you can get a blood test anytime you want to, to make sure all your levels are good and everything, like, just so I don't freak out, because I was already like, oh my god, oh my god, and like, worrying about everything, and <laughs> having an anxiety disorder and not being able to take any anxiety and medication now, I'm just like, yeah. Um, and you're... And like your, I don't know. I just feel, I feel like my emotions are definitely a lot higher. I'm sleepy, sir. <laughs> my emotions are definitely heightened. Um, a lot more like up and down really quickly sort of thing. Um, yeah, so <laughs> my anxiety has been just absolutely crazy. But um, I've been hopeful and happy and everything is, is really good especially today I feel a lot better today um, and after seeing him I just felt so much better and reassured I'm waiting for my HCG results which is really nerve-wracking but um, everybody is like don't worry it's all good like it seems like everything's great um, I'm already five weeks and four days along which is insane to me because yeah I found out at like five weeks one day <laughs> Um, which is so like late, but it was just a complete surprise because we only baby danced one time naturally last month and it was literally just perfect timing and we were like, what? Like, it's crazy. And I knew that was going to happen just in my heart. I'm like, the one month that we're like really stressed out and we're just going to like, we didn't even really try. That was just like a natural thing. And then, <laughs> of course, that's the month that we got pregnant, so... That's awesome. <laughs> but yeah, um, 
some of my other things. I've been feeling very, very nauseous. Um, especially when I haven't eaten or I'm starting to get hungry and my stomach has been like real- I've been not feeling hungry. Well, I guess I have been feeling hungry, but my stomach literally like the second I'm hungry it's like like super growls and it never usually is growly like that and it's so funny and my husband keeps on laughing because it's so loud every time and he's like, I guess you're hungry again. <laughs> um, and just... <laughs> Pregnancy sometimes are so embarrassing sometimes. But anyways, constipated a little bit. Um, uh, lots definitely increase in CM, um, like a huge increase, and um, very bloated. Um, sorry, I'm not, I'm just like resting my hand here. Um, and my boobs have been feeling like really full and also um, kind of like, T twingy like pains and like my nipples were hurting earlier today and like it's starting to hurt kind of more um uh what else oh I've been feeling like kind of stretching I guess that's around ligament pain just like in different areas around my stomach it'll be like on the right side then the left side then down below and just like just like a little like kind of twinge um very very mild sort of thing but it's just like you're just aware of it you're like oh okay that's weird <laughs> Um, yeah, and my sleep has been the main thing. That's why I took the pregnancy test was because, oh, I keep on waking up at like four in the morning every single night from a nightmare, like crazy, scary dreams, waking up with a major panic attack. And I was really worried. I was like, why am I like literally jolting out of sleep, panicking and then not being able to sleep again, like go back to sleep again. And my sleep has just been like, I've been going to bed at like nine o'clock and I usually go to bed at like one or two or three in the morning sometimes, which I know is not good. And I try to go to bed earlier, I really do. But, um, yeah, so I've been like really uncharacteristically sleepy at night. I just literally can't keep my eyes open. Like, they actually feel so sore. Major headaches, too. Like, almost migraines. Um, and my, like, that's the main thing, though. Like, in the middle of the, or when I start skidding later at night, I'm just like, uh, I, like, literally can't keep my eyes open. I'm like, I have to go to bed. Because usually I can push through the sleepiness and just be like, I'm gonna stay up and do all this stuff because I'm a night owl. But I'm just like, no, I need to go to sleep right now. And, yeah. I've been waking up really early though because I've been having lots of things to do, but I think if I haven't had all these appointments and things, I would be sleeping in a lot too, <laughs> but yeah, very sleepy. Um, I don't know. Um, I have had some cravings, like I've been really wanting salad, like for the last week, especially Greek salad and cherry tomatoes. I've just been like, oh, I want it so bad. Um, <laughs> I don't know why. And just like really healthy things like water and juice and things like that, which is good. I'm glad I'm craving those. Um, but yeah, so that is where we're at right now. Wish us really good luck, please, and baby dust and pray for us and hope that everything goes really well. Um, yeah, we're very excited, very anxious, but very, very happy and excited. So thanks so much for watching, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye!